Welcome viewers, uh, thank you for clicking on the video and watching or seeing the thumbnail slash title and continuing scrolling. Either way, still appreciated, so don't worry. Granted, appreciated less than those who stood and watched, but I love you nonetheless. Uh, if you somehow are able to like know the backstory or like trace this channel's others like splintering ends you would know that my partner in crime uh, Mitch is currently not here understandable nonetheless cause it's 550 in the morning so anyway uh gonna be doing some some fishing today no, get some uh, some training. Currently going for the title of uh, world's best fisher. Gonna compete in the uh, pro bass championships. Uh, target that uh, I currently have designated is uh, listens to no one no authority but himself <clears throat> get that oh where'd it go did I lose it no nope, it's over here well <sighs> no toys for can't be having that see this is the kind of situation you can't be having during the uh, tournament championships and whatnot. Let's see what we got here. Look at the C Lore 3 Mending 1. Mm. Feel like that'll get me something good. Also, don't mind my uh, worn down armor here on the left. <coughs> I don't know. I don't. I don't really have too many levels, too many, too much XP for that. Just used some to get the damn dexterity on this or whatever it's called. Durability. Yeah, that's a big word. It's not in my brain dictionary. I don't have one. Huh. You think anybody actually keeps pocket dictionaries in their pockets? It is. I wonder what's up with that. That'd be pretty convenient now that I think of it. Imagine, like, ah, what's that one word? It's on the tip of my tongue. That I just can't, just can't, you know, think about it. I think of it right now. It's not coming out. And fucking dude to your left pulls up and he's like, I got you. Pulls out a fucking pocket dictionary. It's just like 900 pages long. Maybe even more. Just starts flipping through it. Speed of light. Huh. You know, it's, it's hard work. You know, this fishing business ain't easy. You gotta get up bright and early. It's, uh, 5.54 in the morning. <laughs> to be honest, should have got up even, even earlier. Say around like a uh, three maybe maybe early four like the max yeah <sighs> these fishies man they, they they know their stuff I tell you you don't get up early it's over they know predators be out in the daytime predators being me
you know, some people, they, uh, they get upset at me, you know, they go, you don't fish for food, you just fish for sport. It's not entirely the case. I mean, sure, I... Why the hell does everything keep dropping all the way over here? Hold on a minute. i got to solve this. Okay. I guess I could drop this. Okay. Okay. Alright, I need to put some stuff in chest. I just put it in here, couldn't I? Nope, sticks. Put this in there till later on. And draw some of this as well. Mm. Don't need a saddle currently. Other I'll put them inside later. <laughs> oh yeah, I just noticed we got a got a book. Inspiration protection. And the flame one. Motherfucking yeah, motherfucking. Yeah. The fuck hey! You gotta get out of it, man. It's dangerous. The, these fishes, man, I tell you, they'll bite. If you're not careful, they'll bite. And they'll bite in all the right or wrong places, considering how you look at it. Uh. Well. Whatever you wanna do, it's what you wanna do. <sighs> Yeah, I went uh went about three times to the Pro Bass Championships. Uh, I got knocked off like uh, around second round, I think I'd say. Yeah, something like that. Not too sure, but gotta gotta come back stronger, you know. You know, uh, people try to tell me that I'm not very good at fishing. You know, they go, they go, why do you, like, try if you're not even good at it, you know? I'm decent. I'm decent. I made it to the championships. I got there. Round two. Right? Just, you know, other people that have way more experience, way more training. I just gotta work my way up to there. It'll happen. It'll happen in due time. You know, I'll be I'll be pulling t t fishes left and right. You know, where they come, I run to, grab them, got them. But things like this takes time. It takes time, definitely. You know, can't can't rush greatness. You know. I mean, in hindsight, it may seem like that's just a, a scapegoat to be lazy, you know, can't watch greatness, but in my case, it's entirely true. I'm trying my hardest all the time, every time. I never get, I never not give 110%, you know, I'm out here. Five o'clock, you know. Five o'clock every morning. I get up, I come out here to these waters, and I show them what I got, you know. I've got a stick, some dental floss, a bottle cap, and a, a droplet of semen on the bottle cap. You know, some people ask me, why do you put a, a droplet of semen on the on the bottle cap? You know, to to go fishing. But what they don't understand is that fish actually thrive off of the uh, the nutrients from the from this from the semen. You know, and they like that. They get stronger. They get bigger. It makes it better for when you want to eat them too. Uh, it's like it's like giving cows hormones and stuff. You know. It's top tier stuff. It's top tier. Yeah. 
I mean, of course, it's just not not all of the side effects that growth hormones have. Uh, you know. I bet some of y'all be thinking, like, uh, how long have I been doing this for? You know, coming out here, pro fishing, five in the morning, practicing, go to sleep, it's like eight o'clock in the morning, take like a 20 minute nap, wake up, you know, get dressed, go out, do my stuff. Repeat, you know. People ask me, you know, isn't it, isn't it boring keeping like a, a lifestyle like that? I just, I just brush it off. You know, it's not, it's not boring. You know, people out here, they have, they have nothing to do. Like, they have. Everyone has something to do. I know that, right? But these people just are here just doing nothing, right? It's boring. It gets boring so easily. You just, oh. What's the issue? What's the issue, pal? I don't want to have to get violent on you. Hmm? I don't want to have to toss you up, man. I'll deal, I'll deal you a good one. I'll, I'll smack you upside the head. I'll deal with the fish. I swear. I would slap you upside the head with a fish. It's not gonna... The fuck was that? <coughs> it's not gonna hurt too much, but it'll... It'll feel very strange. With fish rubbing on your head. Have you ever had that? Huh? You ever had fish... Fish head? It's a, it's a disease. Alright, you asked for it, pal. Oh. Wait, your friend wants some? I'll give him some too. I'll smack up the both of you. I'll slap you silly in the ring. Look at this. Look at this. See? This is a special technique right here. Oh, he dropped gold. See? This is exactly why I do things like this. See, people be like, you know... Violence, it, it just, it just, it doesn't reward you, you know, but I, that's for the weak, man. I'll be honest with you, that's for the weak. Violence rewards me all the time. Look at this. What the fuck? Kind of just jumped over me, Tekken style. Um. I don't know. Also, it's kind of cold here, that's why I'm shivering stuff. I'm gonna drop this as well. See so if uh, you go out, you do some violence, you might earn a goddamn gold bar. Who knows? Hmm. Oh, it's getting late. Well, you know what that means. Time to sleep. I sleep naked with my ass out, going up towards the sky. That way, if there's ever an intruder, he'll be distracted by my ass. My big, bubbling ass cheeks. It gives me enough time to, to strike. I get enough time to strategize and smack him upside the head with a fish. Maybe even two fishes. What the fuck? This. Bruh, bruh. This man traveling at high speeds. Need to relax. Goddamn. Next fucking Hugh Sang boat right there. Jesus. That was some unprecedented speed right there. Anyway, back to fishing. <sighs> I live a happy life fishing, you know. I love what I do and I do what I love. It's... It's 
fairly fun, you know. Uh, it's not all I do, exactly. You know, I, I don't just do this every single day. Right, I don't, I don't come here and fish Sunday through Saturday. No, I do a couple days on, couple days off. I got friends and family as well. I can't, you know, I can't just go fishing, leave that all behind. No. Although I do go fishing to clear my mind, so. But there's a difference between, you know, like loosening the line and just cutting it all together. You know. Not exactly leaving everyone behind. Just getting a little bit away from them. Well, separating myself a little bit. Not too much to where they become strangers, but just enough to where I can forget about them for a couple seconds. A few minutes. A couple hours. Yeah. Ah, lost them. See, that's the kind of things that, uh, I need to worry about, see, that technique right there, it's terrible, terrible, you know, got the old 3-2-1 system going down in my brain, messes me up, like, I forget I gotta listen to the splash, you know, see, there it goes, now I'm getting into a nice rhythm, there it goes, alright, that was useless, See, hold on, why did I um, throw this away? I don't need that. show you guys something different you know everybody's seen fishing before but uh i bet i can almost guarantee you that you've never seen fishing like this uh if i can even do it hold on all right everybody brace themselves okay Th i'm doing this on purpose to give you some time to get ready that was on purpose as well Boom. There you go. Skill. God damn it. Alright. Hold on. Hold on. I got this. Oh. Wait. That's raw. What am I doing? Give me the goods. Come on now. There we go. Hmm. Does anyone else notice that whenever you make something by yourself for yourself that it just tastes way better is it just me? I swear cause like bro I could I could have a sandwich from like Gordon Ramsay or like some mysterious poo poo platter type shit from fucking fucking I don't know just think of some, some goddamn cliche chef name or something, but that, like those, those plates can never compare to the taste of a goddamn homemade PB&J sandwich. Like, come on now. You're telling me you, you get yourself all, all, all tired out? Making that sandwich, spreading that peanut butter, spreading that jelly. And that at the end of all of that, you don't just like, almost burst at the satisfaction of the first bite. Of that goddamn PB&J sandwich. If you were to tell me that, I would tell you, you were lying. If you were to tell me you don't, you don't almost piss and shit in your pants. Eating that first bite. I would tell you that you're you're lying to me. I would, and I I don't normally, you know, pin things on people, calling them liars and stuff. But I would do it to you. I would. Cause, goddamn it, 
That's it's treason. It's treason. It's really what it is. You're turning your back on the truth. Oh um. Well, don't mind my lack of having facial features. That was on purpose. Um I have no food. I need to need to cook some food. Oh, I got fifty three raw card. I think that'll do. Oh somebody left some cooked salmon in there for me. Thank you very much. I'll enjoy that. That was actually most likely me as well. Alright, just one. I guess I'll just have one fish for several hours. That's how that works. Anyway, I'll, I'll let that cook up, but... Aw, oh, damn. Uh, raining. God damn. Maybe you can still catch some fish. Hold on. Let me, uh... Let me get up in the spot. Huh. Huh. There we go. See? See? I had to add in the grandpa uh, grunt that gave me the extra strength I needed. Mm. Alright, let me go. Boom. Now, you've seen fishing, but if you've never seen it like this before, this is fishing on extreme. This is fishing extreme, yeah. That's, that's what I meant to say. I wasn't going to say fishing export or something like that. X Games. You know, I've only watched X Games like once in my life. Uh, it's not that I have a problem with it. I just, I'm just, I'm just saying. I only watched it once. Why? I don't know. Why did I watch it? I also don't know. Uh, I think it was just on television, and. Then so, so goddamn backflip, 360 heel flip, kick flip, fucking varial heel flip, switch switch, 360 on the goddamn motorcycle, and I was like, bruh, I gotta watch this now. So that's how that happened. Whoa! It's leveled up. Oh, give me the fish. Fishes are chill. Uh, oh, I've been in this business long enough. Nah, I think I'm able to determine that fishes are chill. You know, they're not, they're not too, too wild or aggressive, really. I mean, if you got them in your hand and you're like trying to scoop them up or something, you're gonna try to wiggle out. I mean, anybody would. I don't think I would want to be in somebody's hands, not knowing if they fucking jacked off, got pre-cum in there, or, I don't know, or fingering themselves earlier. Who knows, you know, who knows? People do disgusting things. Maybe they ran out of toilet paper, take a shit, you know. It's moments like those, gotta do what you gotta do. I don't blame them, but, you know, I'm not gonna touch your hand. After that, <laughs> I mean, you know, it's, it's kind of sad that people get offended because of it, you know. It's like the dude shed and wiped with his hand like I, I i don't find that an issue like you do you right only part that i do find an issue, an issue is that like you want to shake my hand afterwards like i don't want to shake your hand it's not it shouldn't be forced onto me you know whether i gotta shake the hand or not fucking 
He's got shit hanging off his, like he took a scoop of Nutella out the jar with his hand. It's disgusting. I don't, I don't want to shake that. It's moments like those where I kind of feel like Maurice, you know. Just don't want to move it, move it. Whoa. Some good stuff for you. All right. I would do some. Huh. Oh, that was a yawn. Um, I'm gonna do something y'all ain't never seen before. Ready? Boom. I'm not gonna do it again. It took way too long. What the hell? You see, I, I don't mind people. You know, being here and watching me, watching me fish and stuff. But when you're on my property, it's kind of, it's kind of weird. It's kind of weird, you know. It, it throws me off a bit. It's a bit unsettling, you know. It's like, and my property's big, right? My pro, uh, you know, I'm kind of privileged here. See, I, you know. Basically a condo, or so um, got our own little farm and stuff. So yeah, I guess guess we're a little privileged, but it doesn't doesn't change the fact that I don't like being watched by people I don't know. In my own house it throws me off, man. I don't like it. Puts me off my game. I have to take care of them. If I don't, it, it's just gonna. <sighs> gonna fuss me, you know. <sighs> Pretty sure everyone hates sand, right? Like the feeling of sand between their toes and stuff. Everybody hates that, right? Like sand in your food, like sand in in your mouth, sand in your eye. Oh, that's the worst. Getting sand in your eyes like getting your cherry popped for eye droplets. It's like so much burning and like tears running off. You just you just think you're gonna die at that point. You know. You're like halfway, you just stop and you're like, I think this is it. You know, this is this is my death. And I I remember one time putting eye droplets in my eye and thought I was done for, I thought it was a goner. You know. Closed my eye for one second, I think it's blacked out. Couldn't see. Thought it was over, thought I was dead, you know. But the big man took me. But nah I just I was just crying. It's like damn. Thought I was dying for nothing. Huh. I kind of wish my food bars went down faster, but at the same time, I don't. Also, there's two creepers over there, and that worries me. I'm thinking I take everything off, go over there, and allow the <coughs> excuse me, allow them to kamikaze me or something. Uh. You know, a lot of people are like uh, uh, in in like caves and things of the uh, of the sort. The uh, cave spiders are like the most dangerous. You know, they, they poison you and they're fast as hell. But I kind of think I'm I'm kind of thinking you know, uh, cave creepers are the worst. You know, I mean, if you're not watching everywhere at all times, 
it's it's already over like it's if you don't have owl vision to be able to like twist your head and then it's like see everywhere it's over that's that's the weakness that I hate having you know but being someone that goes into that kind of environment a lot I've kind of trained myself to be able to handle twisting my neck 270 degrees uh, although I will not be displaying that to anyone ever hopefully not alright I'm thinking wrap this up here and uh, get going to the next project again I don't always fish you know I have a life outside of fishing if I was always a fisher I I wouldn't have you know any experience in anything else kinda bad you know if you don't have any experience in anything else and it's kinda a one trick pony and I don't I don't wanna be a one trick pony I wanna want to be a uh, I don't know how many tricks are there that a pony can can like know are all ponies one trick ponies have I, have I been saying one trick pony my entire life for no reason I could have just said pony mm, I don't know whoa almost forgot about that <sighs> Bro, can you imagine working at a steel mill? Nobody, children's and like children and like fucking sixteen hundreds be like. Whoa. I don't know, about eighteen hundreds or something. That is dirt. But imagine going to a restaurant and the waiter serves you just dirt blocks with a little bit of grass on top. Just tops it off with sriracha. That'd be beautiful. Ah, man. It's so cold. It is making me kind of sleepy. Uh, what, what do you, what do you uh, reckon we turn this into a sleep stream? <coughs> Dirt. Did I fill this in? Did I? I swear, if I filled this in, this was the most useless filling in ever. Because I, uh, I was just going to come back here to break it up again. Oh my god. No, I don't think I... I did not fill this in. No, I don't think I did. Oh, right, my shovel go. Give it back. I want another one. Here, I got you. Whoop. Breaking blocks and sucking cocks. That's what I say. It's my saying. It's my catchphrase right there. Anyway, any of y'all steal my catchphrase? It, it's it's copyrighted, so I'll sue. I'll do it. I'll sue. The moment I hear it, it's over for you. I'm gonna watch every second of your video, or whatever you put it in, and I'm gonna find my part. I'll murder you as well. I'll have it declared as like 
a stroke or something, but it is it was it's gonna be me. It's gonna be me, yeah. I'm gonna be begging for my mercy. You know, if there's anyone that I kind of feel bad for, it's the people in movies that like are associates with the with the bad guys, right? And then they get fucking clobbered. Like Batman will just bust in and start breaking bones and smashing bodies. Like he'll he'll pick him up by the legs and just slam him against a wall, break his legs. Like his legs curve around like a, a door frame or something. And then he'll be like, talk. Like the bo I would talk, but I'm in so much damn pain. Like please, wait a couple seconds at least. Shit. Loki, I feel like Batman deserves to get tortured. I mean, like, shit, he, he put these people through so much. Like, they just low life goons. Then again, they chose a life of crime, so kind of their fault. I mean, <sighs> I would like to see what type of torture someone would have to do to Batman for him to break. I mean, people always like. He's a bad man, he's never scared or stuff like that. It's like, bruh. You sure? You sure about that? What if he had fucking What's it called? N uh goddamn clips with electricity just like flowing through them attached to his nipples and then some dude shoving a fucking plunger handle up his ass. Then you got Stacy over here burping and farting in his mouth. Poor Batman. Uh, that was a scenario from. I read it myself. And I was just a young moon. I was about two years old. I read all of that. Everything. The ass handle, the fart shit mouth. It made me into the man that I am today. Because now I know that I never want to be a superhero because they could get a like, plunger handle shoved up their ass. the ratio of broomstick handles oh wait no no plunger handles to people just to know if I could run out or if the world will ever run out you know wouldn't be fun would not be fun at all plunger handles are the one thing that bring joy in my life Without plunger handles, I'd be nowhere, doing nothing. And I feel bad for the kid from um, the prequels of Star Wars. Kid had a whole life ahead of him. Made one movie. And everything just went south from there. Because people want to blame things on kids instead of actual directors. You ever feel like you want to eat something, but like you don't know if you want to eat said something? 
It's like just wanna just wanted to sit there so you could smell it or something. I don't know if you could hear that or not, but that was my alarm. It's my my second alarm to go fishing actually. Yeah. Fishing doesn't wait for anyone. If fishing were to wait for you, it it'd be very bad. It'd be off schedule. No. It just wouldn't be fun for anyone. So just keep it on time. Alright. Let's go ahead and clean this out here. These little side gripples. Mm. I want to fix that so bad, but I don't know if I... Hold on. Okay, hold on now. Hold on a minute. Mm. Wait just a minute. Give me this. Give me that. Give me that. Boom. Switch Rooney. Could have done it from the start, I think. Um. Put on my... I'm going to put on my comforter. Get a little... Get a little warm in here. It's way too cold. I can just turn on the AC, but that's a lot of work. I'm not a hard worker, I'm a hard fisher. Is it getting dark out? Yes it is. Okay. Well, that means shelter. And then I'll restart. Uh, up there again later. I'll do this this mountain one more time tomorrow and then I'll go fishing. Uh, I can drop the dirt, I don't really need 62 dirt, anyway, bo, 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 bo. okay, I did not mean to place that, oh, that just wasted my axe, oh, so, there are monsters near, but, oh my god, Hold on, let me go t lower my AC. damn house look I don't I don't mind a little company from time to time but you gotta leave alright next time you come in I gave you a warning next time you come in here I'm gonna have to carry through with some action okay by action I mean kicking your ass that's what I mean by action alright please let me rest I just wanna just wanna sleep there we go I woke up, brushed my teeth. That's not, that's not a song or anything. I just wanted to say it. Why did I want to say it? I do not know. Don't ask me. I wouldn't know. But what do you mean? I said, are you, what the fuck? Bruh, I'm gonna have to beat your ass now. You know this, right? This shit. Is he inside my house now? Hey! I saw that. This man is a magician! Alright, this is kind of... This is kind of frustrating right now. Could you just come down here and accept your fate? Your, your fate being... Death. Alright, I'll leave you be. I'm too tired for this, man. Open at him. Let's go. <sighs> man. Bro, why do cows eat grass? Like, out of everything. Why grass? Like, I just don't understand it. Who, who was the, the fucking cow that said, Ayo, 
this shit kind of busting. Like what? The f what? Like that shit, bare grass tastes like ass. Like come on now, you can't be telling me you took a whole gobble gobble and say, yo, this shit kind of bumping. Like no, that shit's grass is what it is. Motherfucker, it sounds bland as hell. Grass. Like, come on, you can't, you can't make that sound fancy. Even in the usual accent that can make everything sound fancy. Which is just like, old English. Huh. Ha 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 Cracking up blocks like crazy, man. I'm telling you. I remember the last time I had crack in and out of box. This was like 06. It was insane. I was hoarding the stuff. My uh, colleague. Okay, is there a way that I could like be be relaxed here? And like not have to sit straight up all the time. God damn. Hold on. Let me bring my mic up. I'm gonna stand for a little bit. I'm gonna take a stand. Huh. Does anyone else know that awkward moment when you're like just getting up to do something and everyone else? thinks that you're joining in on like a game or something and then they just like nah bruh nah you sorry I blanked out there for a second what the hell let's just Turn into Helen Keller for a second. I couldn't. There we go. Get a little bite. Yum yum yum. She kind of delicious though. You see, if if a if a goddamn cow would have grabbed the would have grabbed the fish, cooked it and ate it, that would have been different. I would have been like, damn straight, this is your boss. But nah, I'm gonna play eat grass. It's like eating lettuce. I mean, lettuce is okay at times. Usually it's okay when it's like French. I used to think of the tree meister as someone who could control the trees. But he was controlling spirits over me. But I have another one. Wait, no, that's my fish. Hold on. Leave that there. I thought the blocks were tiny floating hats for a second there. Don't ask how. I just did. Oh, 
Oh, man. Who would have known that mining is very difficult? I think that's about good enough here. Took it on a decent amount. Uh, I think the next amount is gonna be like three, four layers maybe. I'm gonna go take a rest. God damn, I am so tired. Like IRL. I I blinked and almost fell asleep. That's how dangerous my my schedule is right now. It's insane. This back. What am I doing, bruh? Just put it over here. God damn cave noises. Hate them. pretty burnt out. I think I'm gonna call this a, a day. Well, yeah. I'm gonna... I'm gonna head out. It's nice talking to you guys. I mean, nobody was... I don't know why I said that. But, um... It's a reflex, I guess. Jesus. Um... I hope you enjoyed you are watching this video and I guess I'll see you in the next one yeah